Hello and welcome back, Faintly Sandly here, and this is Mini Shoot Adventures. If you're following along in the series, we've just defeated the second boss and unlocked a high-powered, uh, what do you call it, a weapon, I guess. And that allows us to blow up rocks and cracked walls and things, and we'll unlock a, uh, a number of new paths that we've uh, uncovered so far. We've also got this little fellow here who's selling some goods. Compass and Ancient Astrolabe, which is uh, overall completion, does let, let you know if you've cleared an area or not. For a village star, which transports me back here whenever I want, which would be good. But I believe we've just bought the level four gun, so you can see there my bullets are shooting four at a time, which is lovely. The second boss was down here. Looks like there's another one up there. Another one here as well. I would like to just have a little quick shoot around. Because I believe with this new tool that I've got, we can unlock some new paths. There are a number of uh, cracked walls and boulders and things all around the area. All around the map, I should say. The... Uh, all of a sudden they'll be accessible to us again. That's just a matter of finding them now. Nice little uh, experience crystal in there. We will find a way into that side. Oh. Let him hide in the tree. I'm going to use my high powered gun for him. Nice currency, and uh, that's it. Beautiful. Yeah, pretty close to leveling up again, which is nice. in a couple of days, so forgive me for being a bit rusty. Keep my eye out for some more little secret paths as well as I go. Where am I? I'm way off. Okay. Didn't realise I travelled quite that far. container piece. Oh, lovely, and that was the fourth one as well. That's a very welcome addition. Alright, let's keep going this way. I can't remember if I've been here. It doesn't ring a bell. Hello? Hmm. Whatever's in there, I can't reach it yet. I definitely going to go north, I think. A little scarab. A few of those now, still not quite sure what they do. Oops. Get out of here. Alright, maybe I can. Oh, is that literally where I've just gone from? Oh, not quite, but I have been here. I really need to stop taking such a long break in between sessions because I find I just completely forget where I've been and what I've done. It breaks the flow a little bit, so I do apologise.
Hey, it leveled up. That's nice. Check that out in just a moment. Maybe I do need to invest in that item that teleports me back to the uh, home base there. Um, okay, we've come to this cave backwards. Take that, thank you. There's a battery over there. Oh, there has to be an item that lets you walk on, oh, sorry, like, traverse water. Has to be. can do this. Light those lanterns with my new super shot, is what it's called. Uh, where is it? Yeah, super shot. That'll open up this path. Ooh, another NPC hidden there. Hello friend. Wonder what he's uh, gonna offer. I'll be another merchant or where is he? That's him. Say hello. He heals me. Okay. That's nice. I haven't been returning to this guy. He um map fragments I think doesn't he any what's points of interest on the map ah there's a little might be an NPC in that cave there but looks of it that's a distress signal I believe yeah that's lost power okay hmm all right might head that way hold on I've got another one for you Oh, I don't. I think I've been there. Shall I remember where I haven't been? In my head it felt like there was uh, breakable walls all over the place, but now that I'm actually looking for them, I don't know where they are. Let me just check on that teleporter item. What's that worth? 14. I've got 11. Um, that's right. There was a secret path in there I discovered last time. Thanks to... Uh, who was it in the comments? Ingvar, I believe. We'll just double back into some of these already explored areas and look for lanterns to light up or walls to destroy. Nothing in this one. Actually, maybe that item that tells me how complete a map section is will be quite handy. Things like this. Nice. Somehow I never came across that before. There we go. There's a breakable wall. Little button. Ah, beautiful. I believe the map said there was a, a missing power or something in there. Is that right? Lost power. No, wait, no, that's a distress signal. Could be another NPC right in there. But, of course, not without a fight. Close. It'll be chaotic. Oh, these guys with their recoil. There's the last one up there. Oh. 
rough. You get out of here. Ah. Uh, you get out of here. There we go. Can't afford that teleporting item now, I think. More fights. Jeez. Isn't it? There we go. Level up again. It's brutal, isn't it? This room. Still that health over there, but too risky at the moment. There we go. Right. Another room. I'm gonna break these jars for me, buddy. Oops. No paying attention. There it is. A little ambush, nice try. Here we go. Another friend trapped in the corruption. Off you go, champ. Now, what is this? Oh, that's nice, it just dropped me off at the entrance. Beautiful. Well, I'm gonna head straight back, I think. I'm gonna get what this new fella does for us. And I might buy that teleport item. Here he is. Idol of protection. The power of protection now stuns most enemies. The power of protection. Three scarabs. Let's see. May as well. Ah, three scarabs for another heart piece. Okay, let me see here. Power of protection now stuns most enemies. I don't think I have that power yet. Okay. Alright. Blue Star is 14, Compass is 2. This one is 65. Adds pointers where you miss something. Right. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get all. Th well, I'm gonna get these two that I can afford. Definitely think it's worth saving for that one. Is it sixty odd? Sixty-five. So. Right. Tick, tick, tick. Tick, 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 tick. Okay. Well, that's handy. If I head back in this direction, there's another palace with a lost power, and then something in this tree, which I apparently haven't done, so. I'm gonna talk to my new friend over here to heal. Thank you very much. I go. So. Only here. But what? Secret on 
have your secret or a path here. Here we go. What are you? A little secret shop. It's five. Reduces boost energy consumption by 30%. That's handy. The blue forest map. I've got 10, so I'm definitely going to get that. And I'm going to get the heart piece as well. Oh, that's nice. Another little NPC down the bottom there. Got a little mazy bit. Gotta get the heart piece as well. There we go. In true Zelda inspired fashion, I will come through here and break all of your pots. Still like some of the money I just spent. Another one over in the desert and another NPC. That's where I might head. Put a tick on it, so I don't need to go in there again. Yeah, I think that compass was a good investment, especially for someone with a memory like mine. <laughs> Might be the lost power thing. Yep, but there is an NPC in there. But this looks like an exit, not an entrance. Definitely. Ah, that helps. Now that I can... Uh, for those. Not gonna re it. Apparently not. Oh, no, not too soon. This is like a mini version of that big worm from the last episode. Oops. Speaking of which, I might have to go find him and hunt him down actually. Aging myself a bit here, but has anyone played uh, a game called Silkworm? It was on the old Amiga or Commodore 64, I believe, and it's like a little side scrolling shooter game where one person plays a helicopter, another player plays a jeep. And it was a sort of a, a military, it was almost bullet hell, but it was like a side scroller shoot em up sort of thing. And I'm just hearing this, these bullets clang off this metal, and it's just there was a sound effect very similar in that game because everything was armoured and uh, it's just brought back a lot of <laughs> childhood memories I was hearing clang 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 but that was a good game alright room clear let's move gonna light that ah okay one torch is lit, there's another path somewhere else. Thank you for the health. There we go. There's another... I mean, there's a hole over there. Which I can also now access. Living pots. There we are. Oh. 
Let me guess. Arena. No. Waiting for the trap. See you later. How do I use this item? I have to be outside. Need to see what that guy does for us. Uh, let's see. How do I use it? What am I missing here? Definitely outside. Oh, on the bottom right there, B. Oh. Only issue with games like this that don't give you, you know, all the text. It's uh if you miss something, which I'm liable to do. Silly. Where is my new NPC friend? Oh, I wonder if he's in that house. Hello there. Nothing for me? Oh, so there's an upgrade button here. I just want to see what that does. You want to see that before? I was sitting there. It said upgrade on the screen. It had a hotkey. I can't tell if it was my usual level up upgrades or there was something else going on. Anyway. Uh, where was I? Head back to the desert. The big worm turns up. Get him. Handy. Watch me forget about that instantly. It's a bit tricky as he takes damage. You can hit the head. OBS just had a little hissy fit there. Hopefully that hasn't affected the green. Probably just did it a little bit, so apologies for that. Don't worry me, where are you? Stop taking this stupid damage if I'm wanting to kill him. Ah, oh, 
Ace. Ah, uh, do I have a... I must have a power-up that uh, increases my damage when I'm low on health by the looks of it. But I've also forgotten about. <laughs> before I forget all about it. Ah, oh, it's a race. Tricky one. To handling these tight turns. I was sort of keeping up until then. Oh yeah, it's up to now. Sort of upgrades I'll need to be able to do this. I mean, I know I'll have to get good. I feel like even my top speed wasn't going to get it done there. Alright, here's another little palace here. Ah, that's got a picture of the worm on it. Nearly got him. Don't run away, coward. Really like some. Oh, there he is. I'd really like some health right about now. Ah, oh, that was so dumb. I'm gonna blow this on. Come on, come on. a bit more dangerous, isn't he? There we go. Feed the Desert Guardian. Achievement unlocked. That'll open this. Rewards. Level up again. See what we've got in here. Couple of paths. Hmm. What's the penalty for dying? Strange feeling I'm about to find out.
So, das mache ich. Take that, thank you very much. Okay, what's up here? Uh, two more lanterns to night, at least. What the? I need to go the way. Down right, right, there we go. Well, that's good. There might be one up the top there as well. What am I supposed to do here? Never need to go in the top first. And I'm nearly dead again. There we go. What happens? Oh yeah, the upgrade prompt was just telling me about my level up points. Damage, fire rate, rain, move speed. Damage or move speed? Chuck one in damage, why not? Try this again. <laughs> so, <laughs> what I'll do, run straight into it. Okay, push this button. Try not to die instantly. Super shot helps a lot. I think I might have just done a pause for a second. Yeah, but that OBS is uh, not giving me a good time for some reason. lanterns down. We still have a uh, bullet to walk into. This is just branching path after branching path. Yeah, okay. another scarab that's nice. That'll give me three if I catch him. And I can trade that for another heart piece back at the uh, village. There we go. Lantern lit. Does it open that path? No, it doesn't. What is wrong with me? Uh... That can't be it, surely. There's got to be more to this. Ah, oh, that path up there, of course. Um, where am I going? There, right. Left. Down. Left. Up. Left. There we are. Hmm, sure this isn't a trap. Help. 
myself cornered. There we go. that that I needed to but anyway that door's open what do I have here when at low health plunges you into anger and fear to double your critic chance that's what that is okay suck so badly this time. So far so good. Brutal, actually. <laughs> That's the last one. Let me out of here. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, oh, that's real special, that. <laughs> Getting impatient now, I'm just flying into everything. Tells me something's happening. Here we go. Like a scarab. Here's a tip, don't turn around and I can't do anything. little wave patterns there. up with this spin or hang back wait for my gun to charge and use the super super shot on him there 
There we go. Another level up. Nothing else of note around the arena. Doesn't look like it. Oh, what is this? Hold of the crystal. The power once mine is now thine. Gather energy from the blue crystals and use my power to exit this shrine. Interesting. Well, now I know what these crystals do. That's good. That appears to be a time power. that one more time cool there you go new power unlocked well, what sort of use is that going to have is there anything in here that I missed Oh, this is the race, yeah. There's one more cave up here, I'll check before I teleport home. Has been a productive session. I want to see what I'm missing here. Oh, yep. Another one where I need to be able to float over water. Oh, actually. Ah. I was going to suggest maybe the time one would let me do it, but nothing there to let me charge that power. I need one of those blue crystals, don't I? Right, going home. Going to... What am I going to do? That's right, I was going to buy a heart piece with some scarabs. Okay, what else is telling? The idol of time. The power of time slows time even more, except for you. Okay. Seems like a logical upgrade. Hey. Okay. One thing I do want to check on. So the other desert building like this had a little symbol of the worm there. When I killed the worm and it opened. But what is this? Is this one of those tree creatures? One of those bloody bush things that I bought in the recent episode. Do I buy this? Reduces boost energy consumption. I think I think it's worth it. This guy can have a holiday because he's got nothing left to sell. There you go. Uh, oh, that has a little tick on it now, I think. Alright, so big bush enemy, where is that? Right there. <laughs> Simple as that. That makes sense. Alright. Oh, okay. I'll quick look in here. So 
That's so good. I do like these little Zelda style dungeons. Work really well in a game like this. Alright, nearly got another hard uh, piece. Hard container, I should say. Better got those damage upgrades, I think. Gonna be making sure work of these enemies. Another scarab. Oh. And dodged out of his way. There we go. Nice. Another path opens there to the right. Oh, I thought that was a platform for me. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> okay, that's half of any path open. The other way now. <laughs> what a waste. in this room anyway, it's just, oh, hang on. I reckon there's something in there. have to check. No. <laughs> Always got to check. What the... Oh, it's those instant kill bullets. Oh, you're up there. Okay. Thought I was starting down there. Alright. Be a bit smarter about this now. I don't know that'll kill me instantly. Open. Secret there. Another level. Move on. present 
very close to leveling up again already. Alright. So the path should be open now. Let's see where it takes us. dungeon like that belongs to this fella. He's not so scary now. I think I was meant to kill this one before the other one. This feels like the uh, the basic version. <laughs> and yet another level. Is that a floating device? I don't know what that is. Might, might destroy bullets or something. It looked like a floaty, a floaty ring. And I thought, oh, that's how I um, get over that water. Ah, uh, power of protection. Okay. Which means power of protection now stuns most enemies. That's what that relating to. All makes sense now. Very cool, it's got 17 coins, I've got one scarab. And I did pick up another map fragment, didn't I? I'll let you do your work. Yeah, a few more places of interest on the map. Very cool. Alright, well that was a productive episode, wasn't it? So, another heart container. Leveled up a bunch. Bunch of artifacts. Two new powers, slowing time and the power of protection. So that's, uh, yeah, been quite productive. So I might wrap up there, so thank you for watching. If you like this, please give me a like and a subscribe, it helps me out a lot. Subscribing keeps you up to date when I drop new videos. And uh, as you can see, I like to cover indie games of all sorts. So if you have any game recommendations, let me know in the comments below and I'll do my best to get back to you. So thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time.